Hey, 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 welcome back to the Gourmet Gambit, folks. Today we're gonna make a ham and cheese stuffed pork roast with some beautiful spices. And one of the key spices are the seeds of paradise. Let's make this really tasty. I'm Wes, let's get started. So we got our pork roast. Maybe we can use the fruit net again. If not so, we're gonna use some kitchen twine. We just have to see if we can get this on again after we added the stuffing. We're gonna cut it like a two centimeters thick fillet. Here we go. We're gonna flatten our roast a little bit. First we're gonna salt our roast. And here is one of the key spices, grains of paradise, very complex flavor, they're beautiful. Caraway seeds, a little bit of grated parmesan, parmigiano reggiano. Then we're going to put our slices of ham, our emmentaler cheese. And on this side we're going to put some fennel seeds and again some grains of paradise. Then we're going to roll it back up. And we got our fruit net back on again. And here we go, on the outside, we're going to keep it very basic, just a good meal of sea salt and a good pepper meal. Put some butter in your oven pot, medium meat, and we're going to fry our roast on the outside, lightly brown. In the meantime, warm up your oven up to 160 to 170 degrees Celsius for a few sprigs of thyme on each side, a few bay leaves, one or two hot chilies, put the lid on, the oven is at 160 degrees Celsius and our roast is going to bake for three hours. I never wash mushrooms in water because they're like sponges, they absorb a lot of water and that's going to reduce the flavors of your mushrooms. Just a little brush. We're not going to cut our mushrooms, we're going to use them whole in our sauce afterwards. Some lukewarm water, veal stock, three tablespoons is enough. And we're going to add this to the roast after two and a half an hours of baking. Take about two teaspoons of grains of paradise and we're going to crush them grossly. Here you go, and at the very end, when the roast is done, we're going to sprinkle some over the roast and mix the rest into the sauce. So we're two and a half an hours on the go. We're going to add our mushrooms and our veal stock, and we're going to put our roast back in the oven for another half an hour without the lid. So look at that big boy there, very tender. We're going to take the sprigs of thyme out of there. We're going to put half of the crushed seeds of paradise in there. Same thing for the roast. The rest of grains of paradise on there. Oh yeah! I hope you enjoyed the recipe. And so my dear gourmet friends, I wish you bon appetit and see you back soon.